for a while, I was conflicted on where I wanted to focus my streaming efforts. And I still am a little bit conflicted, although now I have a little bit more clarity. So the story goes, I started live streaming on Reddit uh, maybe like two years ago now or a year and a half ago or something. Like I think last summer of 20, what year are we in? 2020. So last, we're in 2021. I know that, but I'm saying last year was 2020. So yeah, I started live streaming on Reddit and it kind of blew my mind. It gave me an opportunity to interact with people across the world and uh, really um, practice playing the piano in front of people, in front of people or for people and something that I hadn't done really at all prior to that. And um, it was, it just blew my mind how many people you can reach on Reddit. Um, and so I did a lot of, of streaming on Reddit over the past, I mean, I still do occasionally over the past year, year plus. And in that process, I started doing some more research on other platforms that were out there, live streaming platforms. So of course, Twitch, um, of course, YouTube Live, Instagram, you know, Facebook. Um, there's some smaller ones like Trubify and Volume and all these other ones. And I uh, I started streaming a little bit on Twitch and did some research and, and saw that, you know, some people were saying that Twitch, um, they were leaving Twitch for YouTube. And I was like, well, if they're leaving Twitch for YouTube and I have YouTube already, why don't I just stream there, stream on YouTube? I already have an audience there. Like, why the hell not? Um, so I did that for a little bit. And it's, Twitch and YouTube are, are still so different. Even though YouTube has live streaming, Twitch is for live streaming, for live streamers. And it has tools and things there in place, like raids, like streamer song lists, like bits, like all these things that are there that are kind of like, missing in action on YouTube. Um, and so I became an affiliate on Twitch. And then I decided to revoke my affiliate status because I wanted to live stream on multiple platforms. And I knew that you weren't allowed to do that, you know, if you're a Twitch affiliate. And so I did that and then started streaming more on YouTube and Trubify, this app that I'm multi-streaming on right now, that I think Trubify is, is amazing. The only thing that's missing there is just the audience, but it's it's a new app. So I think the audience will come, uh, you know, with time, but their payouts are incredible um, compared to some of these other platforms. Uh, but everything, it's like a, it's a, it's a um, give or take kind of, kind of situation. Hey man, thanks for joining again. Appreciate you. It's a give or take kind of situation. So like right now, my uh, thought process is that I want to, multi-stream. I want to be here on Twitch for sure. I want to be on Trubify. Um, maybe not YouTube so much. I've, I've seen other producers who I look up to and content creators on YouTube who I look up to and really follow their work. And um, and I see them live streaming, uh, you know, on Twitch. And I asked some of them, I said, hey, you know, I'm just out of curiosity. Why not? Why not stream on, um, on YouTube where you have your audience already? And their response was very similar to the reason why I stopped streaming on YouTube is that it's not really, I don't think it's great for live streaming right now. People don't really use it that much for live streaming from what I can see, uh, unless if it's like, you know, lo-fi girl or one of those types of things. Um, so that's where, that's where this takes me right now. I'm excited. You know, I, tomorrow I'm going to spend some time getting a schedule together for my live streams. I want to, I have, you know, I'm blessed that I have some time to kind of, you know, dedicate towards this. So I want to kind of go in on it a little bit. I, I can do it. I enjoy doing it. So I want to, you know, do this whole 1% better each time thing and kind of implement something new each time and uh, and meet people like Anthony here. Appreciate you joining and joining back, bro. And uh, yeah, so that's 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 what it's all about. It's a it's a it's a natural thing for me now. I, I just even even what I'm doing right now, like I'm thinking about my live streams and I'm thinking about all these different things that I've thought about over the past several months that I wanted to turn into YouTube videos. And I'm thinking I have to set up, I have to edit, I have to do this, I have to do that. I have like a lot of things that you have to do in order to get yourself prepared and ready to go for a YouTube video uh, and then officially release it. But if I'm 
live streaming already and the quality if i get the quality like this or even better if i figure out how to make it not at all laggy like i, I think anthony said it was a little bit so if i'm able to get it like really really solid um i can just take this and this can be the youtube video of certain things that i want to say that i can get out a lot easier um from just repurposing content so yeah this is exciting i'm excited for it uh and yeah okay <laughs> now it's time to get back to some music <laughs> 